Hey, what's going on tech fans? Welcome back Tech of Tomorrow. I'm Eric, your host. So check it out. Previously, we showed you guys the RX 470 Red Devil Edition from the people over at Power Color, and you guys saw that card was pretty badass. In fact, its clocks went from 1206 to 1270 on their car, which is a vast improvement over their standard card, pushing it almost into the spec levels of a 480 and making it very, very fast, as you guys saw in that last video. Now, the thing is, the BIOS that we used in that video was kind of crappy. The card wasn't running at its true potential or anything else, so we got the new BIOS and we updated the card. Now everything's running really excellent. Now, a 470, it has 32 compute units, and a 480 has 36. So right there, there's not too much of a difference. And with the memory on the cards, AMD has pushed this memory to its maximum. They've really pushed the memory. So overclocking the memory is pretty much a no-go whatsoever. But you guys will see in today's video that the 470, the Red Devil overclocked, is reaching almost the same speeds as a 40. Just a wee bit of difference between the two. And the price difference between the two is not that much whatsoever. So we use Wattman for all of our overclocking and all that stuff. But without any more further ado, let's jump in real quick. Let's check out our test system which is based off an i7 6700k which we keep pretty much on turbo mode all the time at 4.4 gigahertz you guys have seen most of the other specs before if you watched our other videos we've got a nice motherboard from asrock we've got some g skill memory rip jaw stuff so all in all pretty cool test system the driver we used in all of our tests was the amd crimson software 16.8.1 driver now as we jump in and we check out the benchmarks, you guys can see that overclock, the 470 is doing really, really amazing. I mean, it's reaching clock speeds that are almost the same as a 480. So if you're looking for a card that's going to be entry level but still have a lot of headroom, this card is the one. So now let's just totally jump in and let's check out the benches. As far as attempts go, you guys can see that with the very first BIOS we used, the car was getting about 69 Celsius. But with the new BIOS, the car jumps up to 79 Celsius, which is running a little bit hotter. But still, the card, if you push the voltage up even more, it might do better. I don't know if it might fry your system out, but if you do some crazy cooling and do some crazy stuff, you might even be able to get the 470 to go even farther, as you guys can see in these results. We were able to overclock the Red Devil 470 to 1335 megahertz, which is a whopping overclock for this card. All right, so there you guys can see the Red Devil RX 470 for the price range is a really seriously kick-ass card. I give it an editor's choice here on the channel because this card, for the price range, NVIDIA cannot touch this card at all with that price range. NVIDIA has some cards at a higher price range, but at this price point, there's nothing that can beat AMD whatsoever. They are the king definitely right now at the entry level thing. And this card shows to be one serious, serious competitor. Now, we were getting between five 10% of an overclock with the card. You guys saw, you know, the overclock on that thing was amazing. 1,335 megahertz on the overclock. Come on. Entry level card that's under 250 bucks and these great scores. All the games, everything are playing really nice. Um, 
I don't really know how well VR is going to work on this card. I mean, it's, it's, it's you know labeled for VR, but I don't know. I'm still waiting to get my VR stuff. But hey, for right now, if you're looking for a really seriously kick-ass card, I mean, you guys can see it's really running close to the 4E. Now, obviously not the Red Devil 4E, which we definitely have coming for you. That'll be our next video coming up, just to let you know. We were just waiting for new BIOS and stuff to come out to give the card its actual best representation to you, so I don't hear any crazy hate from people going, wait, why didn't you wait? So, at the end of the day, hey, I gotta say, Power color, Red Devil RX 470. You can see it overclocks well for a card in this price range, even pushing up there to a 480. Like usual, we'll have all the information for this card down below that like button. Hopefully you will go Jackie Chan style on it. And we'll see you guys back here for the next video, which is the Red Devil RX 480. See ya.